cut some of the figs off of my tree and I didn't really want to throw it out so I figured well I'll just put it inside the house. Uh, I only cut one of my favorite fruit uh, which is mission and so and I think I have an LSU as well and then I have the other one I forgot what was their name so yeah this is from the mission and uh, black mission and LSU it's a good fig it's very sweet LSU mission is perfect sweet I love them um, you really don't need soil for now you don't really need dirt to grow them for now um, so yeah this ain't go much better um, you just need a vase and water and it's been sitting here for a week and a half now and it's doing pretty well you know so instead of you try to put roses in this vase or just grow your roses or do whatever roses grow figs instead because I think it's a very good experiment it's an awesome experiment I've done this before last year but I did like um, summertime so the heat really got to it and it didn't do well so right now it's winter so I was trimming down my trees and stuff so I figured okay let me try this because this is one of my favorite tree anyways you should try this at home it doesn't hurt a thing you can try as much put as many fix cutting into your vase Growing incredibly nice, and this little guy here is really coming up. But give them, give them some time until they're rooting, and then you can start uh, putting putting them in uh, soil until they grow, they grow their root permanently. And you can do this as a gift, put in a container and give it away as a gift. I think it would be a great gift if you've done this. You know, instead of bring flowers, you say, hey, I bring you fruit tree, fig tree. So yes, you don't need, it doesn't need much work. You just put it in a vase, mix your window, keep it cool, not too hot, because you don't want the water to be super boiled, you know, heat from the sun. So, yep learn and grow.